Hey everybody, good afternoon. It's October 19th and I'm coming with my 19th tip for ADHD awareness. Um, today's tip is ADHD coaching um, and I want to make the distinction between ADHD coaching and therapy. So yesterday's tip was therapy. Um, when you're feeling overwhelmed, when you need help, um, when you're feeling like you've got that anxiety and depression and these other symptoms coming in and affecting your overall quality of life, that's therapy. And therapy is wonderful, and it will help you work through underlying trauma and emotions and all those other things that you need to sort out so you can move ahead in your life. Um, ADHD coaching, which is what I do, is to help others, especially with ADHDs, children, kids, and adults, manage their time more effectively, um, organize themselves better. It's a lot of accountability and checking in. Um, so when I'm meeting with a client, we'll have that first free call where I kind of go over their goals. We kind of figure out some of their values, um, where do they want to make, cover the most ground in life. And then because I've worked with other ADHD clients and I have myself have ADHD and a household full of it, um, I'm definitely able to give you strategies that have worked for students and clients over the years. Again, I've taught uh, students for 12 years and given the fact that about 10% of the population have ADHD, um, and I've taught almost 2,000 students, that's 200 people. I helped in the classroom managing strategies for getting work done, being productive, um, making movement on those big goals, right? Like, how are you going to get from point A to point B if you feel like you keep going in a circle because your ADHD is holding you back? So that's what an ADHD coach is here for. Um, I can give you specific strategies to help you move forward with the goals that matter most. When you make produ productivity, when you reach those goals, you get more productive because you build up that motivation that a lot of us are lacking. So again, this isn't medication. Um, this isn't therapy. This is strategies to help you move forward on goals and um, time management, the skills you might be lacking in with a lot of way out of the box ideas on how to get it done. Uh, one of the gifts of ADHD is that brainstorming ability. So I have tons of resources um, and tips and tricks I use to get those goals done for you. So if you're looking for an ADHD coach um, or if you have never heard of it before, reach out to me. Ask me a question about what it is. Um, it's very helpful. I'm actually doing um, a boxer style right now, which is why I'm actually going to be recording messages to the person daily for check-ins. So it's a really low rate. If you're interested and you have ADHD and you've wondered, hey, I want to make more progress in my life. How can I move ahead? Reach out to me. Let me see how I can help you. Um, if not, if I'm not the one for you, please look up ADHD coaching and find someone in your area. There's ways to make progress so we feel productive even with our ADHD. All right, so that's my tip for the day. I'll see you all.